what's up and welcome back everyone today's mukbang now y'all know i love trying stuff y'all won't believe what i found in stores bam they are the extra flaming hot fire zone doritos now i've only seen the regular flaming hot doritos and i'll try to insert a picture somewhere but when i saw these they were the only bag on the shelf and i've never ever seen these in stores so when i saw them i had to grab them y'all take a look there goes extra extra flaming hot fire zone yes yes so I'm going to be trying these today and y'all I'm scared my mouth gonna be on fire my mouth is gonna be on fire y'all like I can already tell my mouth gonna be on fire but we gonna see all right they smell like the regular ones too too many all right and helping me assist my taste test i have some sour cream and some nacho queso so all right um first impression look they look just like the regular regular you know flaming hot doritos like they literally look like the regular doritos so Look, y'all. Yeah. So it's not like they look like they have extra seasoning on them or anything like that. So, yeah, they don't look like they have any extra seasoning or anything. But as far as I can tell, look wise, they look just like the regular flaming hot Doritos. So. Let's get into our first taste test. Y'all could go first. I'll let y'all go first because <laughs> y'all go first and let me know how it is. Mm. All right. tastes just like the regular flaming hot doritos um i've also had those i've done a video with the regular flaming hot doritos and i'll link leave a link to that above but i don't know they don't taste any spicier or hotter than the flaming hot doritos regular regular to me mm. now don't get me wrong <clears throat> they are hot they are spicy just like 
the normal flaming hot cheeto just my bad they are hot just like the regular flaming hot doritos are i just don't think they're any spicier at this point than what those chips are because i mean those doritos are hot like hot hot but i mean these are pretty cool like i was expecting like to be breathing like a dragon hold on y'all I don't know why I put them in two separate bowls this time. Usually they just in one bowl. I mean, they still good. I ain't knocking them. y'all i think i lied maybe i don't know if it was just that one last chip i just ate or the aftertaste my mouth hot now like i'm feeling some heat and y'all ever ate some peppers and it was good going down but then you didn't get the kick of spice until you swallowed it and it's just like the aftertaste is super, super hot. That's what I'm feeling right now. So maybe it's like the the after the aftertaste is where you get that extra that extra flaming hot from. Cause now I'm feeling it's starting to feel some heat. Try to cool it down with some sour cream. Yeah, I can definitely feel some heat kicking in now. Still good. y'all peep that i just blew on the sour cream like i blew the cheese and then dipped it in the sour cream and then blew the sour cream as if it was still gonna be hot <clears throat> i be losing my mind sometimes be able to finish all of these like that's how hot my mouth is getting or I can feel I can feel it in my nose now
And then I was trying to see how long I can go without water. Mm. I don't know if I'm going to make it. I'm going to try to get through this. some water I'll be right back and I'm back This would be good with some notches. I think I'm gonna make some nachos tomorrow and use these chips for them. much more left. Getting down to it. Oh, this got a lot of seasoning on it. Could y'all see that?
Yo, imagine if I had poured more chips on my plate, like I would be dying right now because my mouth is on fire, like on fire. I don't know what they did. I don't know what they did, but these extra flaming hot fires on Doritos are definitely hotter than the regular flaming hot Doritos like and it hits you in the aftertaste like um like it took a while because it's like the heat is building up after you eat so many chips and then BAM it hits you that aftertaste now your mouth is on fire like y'all My mouth is on fire, my nose is on fire, my lips is on fire. Do not eat these chips if you have any cuts on your lips or do not lick your lips if you have any like cuts or anything on your lips after eating these because when I tell you my lips, my mouth and my nose is on fire. Like on fire. Um like I said they are <coughs> they are pretty good um it wasn't like a super dramatic change they are hot in the aftertaste i guess you would have to do like a side-by-side -side comparison between the two to really like tell tell if there's like a whole major difference between the extra flaming hot doritos and just the regular flaming hot doritos i mean the regular flaming hot doritos are hot they good they'll do um but these are hot. I will give them that. They do have that extra kick of spiciness and hotness um, in the aftertaste or aftermath. So I will give them that. Uh, is it something that I would just have to have? No. Because again, like I said, the regular Flaming Hot Doritos would do the same job. They're hot. They're spicy too. It'll give you that kick that you're looking for. So, um... It's really going to be based on preference uh, if you go out for these or just stick to the regular Flamin' Hot Doritos. Again, I'll try to um, post a picture of the regular Flamin' Hot Dorito bag somewhere throughout the video. And then again, these were, I don't know if this was like a limited edition one because it has like a Call of Duty Warzone promotion. So I don't know if that was the case for these. But yeah, it say extra flaming hot. And I know for sure the other Dorito bag just says regular flaming hot Doritos. So again, I don't know if this was like a one time promotion for this Call of Duty Warzone that they have on here. But I mean, if you see them, you can try them. Um. I'm gonna finish them up with some notches, but I mean, they good. They were good. They just weren't an over the top thing for me. I guess I could say at the end of the day. But um, I got them from Walmart. They were like three bucks. I know the bag says four seventy nine, but they weren't four seventy nine. They were like three dollars. So maybe it was on sale or promotion. 
I don't know. This was literally like the only bag on the shelf and I picked them up and bought them. But um, check your local stores or your local Walmarts if you see them. Give them a try. And again, you might want to try them side by side with the regular Flamin' Hot Doritos to see if they really are extra Flamin' Hot or if they're just, just eh. But other than that, that's all I have for you today. Thanks for joining me with my book club and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.